This is a common uh, situation where you're given you're given a bearing and then you're given an angle between that bearing and another line and you want to find the bearing of the second line. So the first thing to realize in doing this that if bearing AB is north 2013-12 east, then bearing BA is equal to south 2013-12 west. So let's go ahead and set this up. We'll start by drawing roughly to scale. Let's draw BA first. So we'll have B in the center. We'll come down to A. It's going to look something like that where B is in the center, come down to A, that angle is 20, 13, 12. And then we turn an angle up to line BC, and that angle hundred degrees or so and again we draw this roughly to scale you want to make sure you end up in the right quadrant when you're done and this angle is 132.04 once you've drawn this then you can tell by observation the angle you want and this is the bearing angle in question Again, by observation, you can see that if you take 180 degrees and you subtract the 100 degree angle and then subtract the 20 degree angle, you'll get that unknown. So let's go ahead and do that. So we'll start off, we'll write 180 degrees as 179.59.60. Then we will subtract the 100 degrees, so we're going to say minus 132.04. Do that math and you get 17.59.60. and then we will subtract the 20 degree bearing angle. This math will give us 44 seconds, 14 minutes, 59 degrees, 14 minutes, 44 seconds, and it is northwest because we we drew this roughly to scale and we could predict, and that's the answer.